Now today I want to talk about something very basic, it really is basic, but it's actually quite important. And that's what I call spraying the palette or spraying your half pan paints. Just so it's kind of ready to go before you make a start. When you have a look on the internet, or even some of the, some of the um, kind of crafty shops, you find little water spray bottles like this, it's all it is, just very very basic, nothing flash. I think this one cost me about a pound, I think it was, it wasn't uh, too expensive. So the idea is, is that you would normally spray I'll do it away from the paint in a minute. I'll do it above it, that's all right. Spray the palette, that should make some bounce. If these have dried up, you can give it a very light spray. You don't need much on there. And also, do the same idea again, just on your half pan paint, just very lightly spray them. Now, I would do this probably about five minutes or so, maybe a little bit longer before I start on a painting. When I remember, sometimes I do forget. So if we give it a very light spray, not too much, you don't want to completely soak it through. Kind of running off there like a waterfall, um, and it would just soften them paints down just a little bit before you make a start. Just kind of makes it a little bit easier as well to kind of mix up your colours um, when you start testing out for the painting. Okay, so that's a little bit about spraying your watercolours, just your half pan paints, and also if you've got any paint left in your mixing palette before you make a start on the painting. So if you've got any questions or comments, please post them down below. I would love to hear from you. And if you've got anything else that you want me to show you, please let me know as well. So until next time around, I'll see you again soon. Bye bye for now. If you'd like to see more watercolour painting tips, head to patreon.com forward slash the Devon Artist and you'll see my full list of step-by-step -step video tutorials on how to paint wildlife in watercolour. Where you get also the project photo, the outline drawing for that month's project as well, and even a step-by-step -step handwritten or hand-typed by me full PDF on that particular current month's project. So come and join me and let's get painting together. And don't forget to click on like, subscribe and share. And please leave a comment down below as well. I'd love to kind of hear your thoughts and find out what you've been up to on your painting ventures. So until next time, bye bye for now.